What's going on guys? In this video, I just want to express why I need you to feel sorry for me. Because if you've been around this channel at all, you know I've been through a lot. If you don't know that, um, then you will soon. Because I have. I've been through so much. So, so much. And I need you to feel sorry for me. It's basically the only reason I post videos. Um, is because I'm just completely engulfed and entrenched in my own self-loathing and self-pity. And I don't want to do that alone. I mean, I need your guys' pity as well. And that's why I share, you know. Why I talk about depression, anxiety, how it pertains to me, my low testosterone, my battles with addiction. It serves no function other than to stroke my ego, pad my feeble and weak emotions, um, and basically hopefully overshadow my insecurity, which is like Mount Everest. As you guys know, I've been through a lot of depression, which most people, like, I'm assuming a lot of you never under you know, know what that's like. It's very unique to me, I think, and i uh, been through a lot of anxiety, a lot of panic attack disorders. I've had low testosterone, which is, I mean, so hard. Very few guys have to deal with low testosterone. I kind of feel like it's basically me against the world in that department. Right there alone is enough reason to feel sorry for yourself, which I do. I struggle with alcohol. Um, everyone else drinks normally, and I don't, and that's not fair, and I didn't deserve that. Um, I'm a victim, you know, so I, some people can just have a few and stop. I have to drink like 15 until I black out and If God had only made me normal, I wouldn't have to deal with that So right there, there should be some pity points added to my pity bank I've been suicidal because my depression was so bad my depersonalization was so bad and uh, And most people in the world have never experienced a suicidal feeling before again I basically think it's just me and it was really painful, and I did nothing to deserve any of this. Like, no life choices have have led to this. This was, I'm, I'm a victim. I shouldn't have to deal with mood disorders. I shouldn't have to deal with life on life's terms. I shouldn't have to take responsibility for my actions and, and the way things are. I shouldn't have to, you know, uh, try to empower myself to get better. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have to do anything. I, I mean, this shouldn't have happened. I feel so sorry for myself. Me against the world. And you guys are lucky to bear witness to my struggles. Um, and and don't ever kid yourself. I am alone in this battle, and I have no support. And um, and I take no ownership over my own life, none. So please pity me. That's the only reason I post. Uh, you know, write comments telling me how great I am, and how strong I am being, and how inspirational I am. You know, just things that can that can build me up, just butter me up a little bit, which is fair. I mean, I make videos for you guys, not for myself. So, um, it's the least you can do is write nice things about me, and tell me everything's going to be okay, and that it's not my fault, and re reaffirm the the simple and obvious answer to my problems, which is to um, wait for things to get better, and take no action, and and obviously just. Hold strong to the self-deprecating nature uh, of my life. So, anyway, uh, I hope that made sense to you guys. I mean, and maybe it wouldn't because I'm the only person in the world with problems. But uh, I just want to share that with you. It's just some viewers have brought it to my attention. You know, they brought up how you know I should stop feeling sorry for myself. And to those people, I say, why would I ever do that? What benefit would it be to my mood, my life, and to others if I I actually took responsibility for things, you know. Fuck that. Fuck that noise. You're watching, which makes sense because I'm amazing. And I'm entitled to these views and I'm entitled to your support and, and having the subscribers that I do, it's it's all part of a bigger plan. I mean I had something to do with that. So I'm special. I'm not just like any of you. Have I said that enough? Do you guys does that make sense? It must have made sense by now. Cool. Well, um, and I hate sarcasm, by the way. And I would never be facetious with any of my viewers. And I would never, ever do anything to, to try to help others. Don't even know why I'm bothering continuing to talk, although you're probably listening, because, again, I basically spit ceremony every time I open my mouth. <sighs> Woe is me. Woe is me. I'm going to go get in the fetal position, one thumb up my ass, the other thumb in my mouth, um, rock myself, and continue to tell myself how great I am, and also remind myself why I should feel so sorry for myself. Myself, 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 myself.
me, me, me. I, I, I. There's no us. Don't ever forget that. <sighs> I feel better though. This makes me feel a little bit better. Just to like speak the truth, you know? Which you guys understand. It's like, I'm not, I'm just saying things that make perfect sense. Alright guys. Um, take care, but most importantly, take care of me. See you in the next video.